basically a project is meant to be mimicking a real world scenario so a project is more close to what you would do on the job so arup uh, welcome you to the session thank you <laughs> what is your background and skill set so basically i started off as a solar system administrator in ibm initially and uh, i was working there as uh, for about 2 years i was in that same particular skill set and then i saw the opportunity to move towards the cloud because i was more interested in cloud computing i wanted to move into development role in between but i could not make the cut so now since i've already been in the system administration role i thought devops would be the best option for me to move ahead so that is about my skill set and my background okay how did you hear about intellipath in telepath i heard through my uh, colleague actually uh, we were having a conversation about moving to this particular role from system administration to devops uh, so we were planning how do we do it and we were also trying to figure out where do we get our skill sets from and how do we do it plan ahead and that's how i heard from him that he was uh, signing up with intelepath and the main thing that really interested me was the fact that uh, there were a lifetime validity of the courses mm-hmm. so that made a big difference for me and that is why uh, and that's how i heard about it telepath how did you find our trainers trainers were definitely uh, enterprise grade i would say whoever have been on the job for at least 5 to 6 years um, because we got on the job experience or whatever was the best practices that they used on the job uh, it was what they taught us even if that meant they had to deviate slightly away from the curriculum that was defined not just strictly following what is there in the curriculum uh, so just trying to give us an overview of the enterprise level and how things are done on the ground so what what would they do as best practices and things like that so it was definitely good to have uh, experienced trainers and who would give you on the job training okay. how was the quality of the course material um definitely the quality of the course material is good and uh you do have access to it 24 by 7 at any time you want on any device so uh, that's a really good thing and uh yeah i mean you do have assignments and projects that are also assigned for your or uh, practicality in order to put put it to use and find out where you stand so i would say overall the course material was good okay. so after completing the course what changes happen in your career uh so i have definitely gained confidence in order to use the technology and hopefully even crack the interview and land my next job in that technology so as of now i just have knowledge which i'm hopeful to put into use after getting a job So in the class did you get individual attention and were all your doubts cleared by the trainers Yes definitely yes um whenever there was any doubt uh, they were definitely going to be cleared at the time when there was a QA session at the end of the session there would be a QA session where or in between before moving on to the next topic usually they clear the doubts related to that particular topic So yes you you can f- feel free to go ahead and ask questions in the Q&A section of the Zoom session and they would be able to answer all your questions uh, of course you need to make sense with your questions but no matter how silly the questions are uh, still it were being answered by the the trainers okay. how did you find our assignments and projects so assignments and projects especially assignments it will help you remember what you have learned the critical parts of what is needed uh, it may not always be what you would do on the job but at least it will let you know or help you remember what you were taught theoretically about that particular session so uh, when it comes to projects obviously a project is meant to be mimicking a real world scenario so a project is more close to what you would do on the job and uh, given that it is closely aligned with getting your certification from IBM through NASCOM so obviously uh, it's a good recognition to have as Uh, the certificate that you've completed this particular course okay. that's nice to hear would you like to recommend intellipath course to your friends and family yes those who want to move into the field and who are really interested in moving into the field uh, if they come to me for advice on 
how do they start their career on this uh, i would definitely recommend them to take up this course thank you so much for your time it was very nice talking to you anu you too have a nice day bye bye you too take care